you know guys it bothers me that no one has put this up for review because um, before then I was contemplating on buying this NECA head knockers hand painted spider-man bobblehead technically from 2002 and I was trying to look for a review for this and I haven't found it which kind of sucks so I'll just take the risk and do it myself and also yeah the only time I've seen this head knocker in a video is when somebody's doing a collection video and that's really pretty much it and yeah and the reason why I bought this is because I wanted something in my collection for like nostalgic purposes or something that I grew up with and right here this is it the Sam Raimi Spider-Man 2002 movie so there's that and yeah and pretty much it's a bobblehead okay like there's nothing too crazy about this because it's just a bobblehead but um the thing that really um surprised me is that of how tall it is like here is a Marvel Legends uh, Peter B Parker right here and yes he does have a custom jacket that I bought on eBay and put it on him so yeah I, that's really interesting and I also have a DC multiverse Superman right here so yeah that's crazy for something like NECA to, to make a bobblehead that huge, that tall, uh, surprises me considering the fact that their, their body knockers or head knockers nowadays are just smaller in scale. Doesn't really surprise me, kind of like Hasbro with their Transformers, you know, their Transformers bigger um, figures were bigger back in the 2000s and reflected the price range and nowadays uh, Transformers figures are small and uh, they then they charge more so it's like They shrunk and double the price, but you know that that's a story for another time With toy companies just shrinking stuff and charging more, but yeah, like I'm just surprised of how huge this is and I Also have another figure. I'll just take Superman out a uh, NECA um, Godzilla from 1954 so there you go guys, there's your scale. <laughs> Maybe I'll do a couple more, just so uh, you guys can see. Here is Wonder Woman from uh, 1984 from, by McFarlane, the DC Multiverse Wonder Woman. So, she's about to fall. Okay, there you go. And then one more uh, Marvel Legends boxed um, Moira McTaggart. And there you go. So. Let's just get started with the bobblehead. Like I said, there's not really much to talk about. Like all he needs to do is bobble his head and there you go. But uh, let's take a closer look. I love how detailed this guy looks. He looks great. He looks exactly like how he does in the film. And this is the 2002 film. They also made other characters like uh, Wolverine and Nightcrawler from X2. They made Daredevil and Elektra from Ben Affleck's Daredevil movie from 2003 and they also made Eric Bana's Hulk from the Ang Lee film in 2003 so yeah you get a lot of options and choices so yeah and describing I, I don't the material of this figure it's more of a cold cast slash ceramic kind of build so meaning that you know, if, if you have a wooden floor and you drop this guy, this guy's going to explode or he's going to shatter in the pieces. And, yeah. And, here's a better look at the body. You can even see the brick detailing on the blue parts of his outfit, which is awesome. And they say it's hand-painted, which, okay, cool. But it's a little bit sloppy, in my opinion. Yeah, like, if you look at the silver webbing just looks like a mess but you know it's kind of and considering the fact that i don't know how much this cost back in the day at least so i don't know the actual retail price that's supposed to be in 2002 because 
I don't know. <laughs> I was five years old then, and this was my first movie theater experience. This film, but the merchandises that I've seen are just the toy biz stuff and the Lego stuff, but not so much this. So I don't really know where you would get this guy back then. But on eBay, the prices range from uh, fifteen dollars, twenty bucks, thirty dollars, and up. So. It just really depends. I recommend the $15 to $20 range. I feel like $30 is just pushing it. But yeah, but considering how, you know, like huge this uh, figure is, I was actually blown away. So, <laughs> but yeah, here's a more detailed look of the back. Yeah, really accurate to the movie. NECA knows what they're doing. So, yeah. Like I said, just a head knocker. That's all. He's supposed to do really so and I love how he's like perched and then you can see like he splits his two fingers like that which is cool but yeah and it just says the spider-man logo right here right here right here and right here so if you guys just want some merchandise you know for this film without spending an arm and a leg for a toy biz six inch action figure which is like what $50 and up which you know they're cool figures don't get me wrong it's just I can't justify paying $50 for that you know so I feel like this I paid $11 for mine on Mercari but like I said on eBay you can find these and you can also find on Mercari for like $15 or something so yeah I totally recommend this this is really nice and it's really hefty too so like I said you have wooden floors Put this on a shelf where he wouldn't be able to fall, you know? So, there is that. And then for the box, it's just uh, NECA Head Knockers hand painted. Uh, the Spider-Man logo right here. And then it says Spider-Man because they also made a Green Goblin in this line. And right here, got a nice looking image. Right here as well. It just reeks of nostalgia. This looks so cool. And then the back and that's pretty much it for this head knocker like i said i'm kind of surprised nobody reviewed this even if it's like a short two minute video you know even though mine is seven minutes but still like i recommend this if you guys are into collecting any of the toby mcguire slash sam raimi spider-man stuff for your collection i recommend this they also made a spider-man 2 um figure or head knocker bobblehead which is a, a little harder to find and it tend to cost more, but I do not think they made a Spider-Man 3, which is unfortunate, but yeah, that's pretty much my review guys. Uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.